It's 10 trivia questions on the Dark Tower series by Stephen King for Patreon subscriber John Burke. This is Trivia with Buds. Welcome to another episode of the Trivia with Buds podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Buds. Thanks for checking out the show and having some fun with me today. This is a nerdy episode for readers because it is all about the Dark Tower series. We've got some fun questions for you on all the books in that series, and that was requested by my friend John Burke. You can pick a topic just like John if you donate $5 a month on the Patreon, patreon.com slash trivia with buds go check it out and uh, see all the different tiers you can get i just ordered a bunch of new swag stickers magnets things like that so all my patreon subscribers will get some fun stuff in the mail very soon and i have tons of trivia puzzles crossword puzzles worksheets and things um, that i have from excess um, from one of my trivia nights in johnson city so i was sending you some puzzles some stickers things like that um, that you can do on your own to uh, help pass the time and Get that brain a moving. Before we jump into Dark Tower trivia, we've got the Geek Out challenges for today. For movies, name four films in which Gwyneth Paltrow appears. For television shows, two shows which have a narrator voiceover. For books, two titles in which a magic potion appears. For music, four iconic jazz musicians. And for miscellaneous, six national chain fast food restaurants. I can do three out of five of those pretty well, I think. So listen at the end of the episode to see how I do. And remember, new t-shirts and designs and swag available on the Etsy shop. Etsy.com slash shop slash trivia with buds. And it's linked in all the show notes. And if you want to do a custom episode for your loved ones for a birthday, an anniversary, a promotion, a graduation... Think about uh, sending me some categories. And 50 bucks gets you a custom episode. You can have it go out on any day you want with any message you want delivered. You can hit me up on Venmo and PayPal about that or email ryanbuds at gmail.com. All right, we're going to jump into Dark Tower Trivia. Here we go. Trivia on the Dark Tower series. Books that I've never read, but after researching some of this stuff... I think I want to dive in. It sounds very interesting. Number one, how many total main novels comprise Stephen King's Dark Tower series? How many total main novels comprise Stephen King's Dark Tower series? Number one. Number two, what is the name of the setting of the Dark Tower series? What is the main setting of the Dark Tower series? Number three, what is another colorful name for Walter Paddock? What is another colorful name for Walter Paddock? Number four, what kind of thing is Blaine the Mono? What kind of thing is Blaine the Mono? Question number five, what's the name of Roland's childhood friend, an original member of his quartet who died tragically before the events of the series? What's the name of Roland's childhood friend, an original member of his quartet who died tragically before the events of the series? Number six, what nexus can be found in New York City on the corner of 2nd and 46th in a vacant lot? Number six, what nexus can be found in... NYC on the corner of 2nd and 46th in a vacant lot. Number seven, what is the name of the company that serves the interests of the Crimson King? What's the name of the company that serves the interests of the Crimson King? Question number eight, what insects are also known as doctor bugs or doctors of Alluria? Number eight, what insects are also known as doctor bugs or doctors of Alluria? Number nine, what's another name for Andrew Quick, leader of the Greys in the city of Ludd? What's another name for Andrew Quick, leader of the Greys in the city of Ludd?
Number 10, Dandelo is a creature who feeds on what from others? Number 10, Dandelo is a creature who feeds on what from others? And number 11, what book in the series was a 2005 British Fantasy Award winner? What book in the series was a 2005 British Fantasy Award winner? Those are all your questions on Dark Tower Trivia. We'll be right back with the answers after this. We are back with the answers to Dark Tower Trivia. Let's see if you got all 11 questions correct. Number one, how many total main novels comprise Stephen King's Dark Tower series? Seven. I believe there is a short prequel to the first one, uh, so you could say eight, but I don't think that's what would be considered part of the main novels because it's so short. Uh, maybe a novella. Number two, what is the name of the setting of the Dark Tower series? Midworld was what I was looking for. There are, of course, many settings uh, throughout the course of these books, but Midworld is kind of the uh, the setting I was looking for. Number three, what's another colorful name for Walter Paddock? The Man in Black, the Man in Black. Number four, what kind of thing is Blaine the Mono? A monorail slash train. A monorail slash train with a personality. Uh, number five, what is the name of Roland's childhood friend? An original member of his quartet who died tragically before the events of the series. Cuthbert Allgood, Cuthbert Allgood. Number six, what nexus can be found in New York City on the second, uh, on the corner of 2nd and 46th in a vacant lot? The Rose, the Rose. Number seven, what's the name of the company that serves the interests of the Crimson King? The Sombra Corporation, the Sombra Corporation. Number eight, what insects are also known as Dr. Bugs or Doctors of Alluria? The Cam Tam, Cam Tam. And number nine, what's another name for Andrew Quick? Leader of the Greys in the City of, the L- uh, City of Lud, the TikTok Man, TikTok Man. Number 10, Dandelo is a creature who feeds on what from others? Emotions, emotions for Dandelo. And what book in the series was a 2005 British Fantasy Award winner? It was The Dark Tower 7, The Dark Tower. Those are all your questions for today. Now, this being a topic that I knew nothing about before I wrote it, I bet there was a mistake in there. Maybe something small, maybe something big. If you're a huge fan of Dark Tower, you can always email me, ryanbuds at gmail.com and say, hey, number seven should have been this, or actually number six is that. I don't mind hearing from you, and I'll try and post a correction on a future episode if uh, something was wrong. But uh, there you have it, Dark Tower trivia for John Burke. We have a fact of the day for you to close things out before I attempt the geek out challenges. Woody Harrelson's dad was a hitman. That's right, Woody Harrelson's dad, convicted hitman. Pretty crazy. We have your Geek Out Challenges for me to try now. Four films with Gwyneth Paltrow, uh, Shakespeare in Love, and uh, Iron Man, and Shallow Hell, and uh, Seven. Those are my four for Gwyneth Paltrow. Two shows with a narrator voiceover, The Wonder Years, and Scrubs. Mm -hmm. Two titles in which a magic potion appears, Alice in Wonderland, and... uh, Magic potion in a book. That's all I got for that one. Uh, four iconic jazz musicians. Oh, boy. Dizzy Gillespie. Uh, Coltrane. Uh, oh, man. Why is that hard? Is Ray Charles a jazz musician? Would they, would people say he's known for jazz or more like rock and roll probably? I got to think. Uh, oh, come on. Who's the bird? The I'm going to say the bird. <laughs> Boy, that was bad. And how about six national chain fast food restaurants? Is it bad that I'm going to kill this one? All right. McDonald's, Burger King, Taco Bell, Chipotle, Chick-fil-A, and, of course, uh, Dairy Queen. There you go. We got six of those, and uh, I hopefully redeem myself from not knowing many jazz legends. But there you have it. Another fun episode of the show. Thanks for listening. Thanks for telling a friend, and we'll see you next time for more Trivia with Buds. Cheers. Thank you.